So we're out here on a salt flat next to the village called Tacoma and we do not have a lot of wind out here. We can hear it a little bit in the bottom, but I would like to show you how the spacer bubble works. This is the microphone without anything on top of it. So this is how it sounds. And now I'm gonna add on the spacer bubble, the bass. And then we can hear how the bass it sounds like. It sounds crispy and clear and it's kind of like not having anything on. And this is very, very transparent. And that's why I made this uh, product because I like to have and keep the best transparency of the microphone all the time. But when you go outside, you need to have some fur. Well, if it's windy, it's not windy right now here in the Dead Valley, but uh, you need to have some fur on top of it. Actually, we need some right now. And I'll put the, the fur on top of it. And then we will see how it sounds like. And this is how it sounds like when you have the fur on top of it. And you can definitely tell that it's going to take some of the high rolls off. But it's always a compromise because you don't want to have the wind blowing into your microphone. So you need to cover it up with fur when you're outdoor and outside in a windy condition. So it's a compromise. You can always uh, give it a little boost in the high ends and then you will kind of uh, be there. But to have the best transparency of the microphone, you will always keep it uh, as naked as possible. Because then you have all the high ends. And this is how it sounds like when you have the bass on it. And to my ears, it's very transparent. So this is the space bubble in the desert. Next to the village called Tacoma, and now it's blowing a little bit. No low cut on the microphone. It's hot. Come on. Okay, I can feel it now.